He walked up to his room and plopped down on his bed. He sat there looking at his ceiling when suddenly he got a weird feeling. Not so much a pain, but a weird feeling. He dismissed it as if some random feeling. He heard his mother call him down to get his stuff, and he walked down to get it. <laughs> so what I like about this is he had a once feeling, again, it, feeling, it seems like a very it, feeling. He, feeling. He, he had a feeling that was a feeling. It wasn't a painful feeling, but, but it, it was, was a, a weird feeling. feeling. It was a feeling. When we went inside the church, we saw that Kimber wouldn't have to do much acting to convince people she was having a breakdown. We found her at the back of the room, tucked into a chair, and a puddle of curly orange hair and tears. Kyle sat next to her and pulled her into a hug. Kim Kimber, what's wrong? I kicked his foot and shot him a look that said, really? <laughs> oh God, <laughs> yeah, I no, didn't think of Kimber, that. What's Kimber, wrong? your mom is just being put in the ground. It's not a big, what's wrong, baby? What's going on? What's wrong? Yeah, what the hell? Did, oh you, did you see that open casket? You see that open casket? Dude, your mom's bloated. It's weird. <laughs> Bro, why does her body look like that? She's all gross and mangled. Yo her, yo, her eyes look all buggy. It's weird, Kimber. What the hell's going on with you, though? Is it your time of the month or something, Kimber? For real? Is this how it's going to be? You, you, we, we, you realize we have a plan today, right? How are you going to fake crying if you keep this up? Gosh! Yeah. Get it together. Exactly. Hey, baby, I know that it's, you know, I know that this is probably an act, but you need to get, get your game face on, okay? We need to find that letter. <laughs> it's like, God, dude. Come on, Kyle. So so oblivious throughout all of his story. It's like so just fucking oblivious. I love it. Walks into a funeral that his girlfriend's mom died, and he goes, "What's wrong, <laughs> bro, Kyle?" Jesus, Kevin, what's wrong? Kyle is one of the boys. He is the most dude, bro. Oh, definitely ever. Like, especially he's just like viciously pulling up his like big ass pants and his like like oversized jacket he looks like he looks like that one talking head concert where they have like the giant suits on he's like kimber what the oh. hell is your problem <laughs> La ladies i want you to imagine that your mom dies and then at your funeral your boyfriend walks in wearing a suit that doesn't fit him and goes what's wrong with oh you <laughs> like <laughs> especially i walked up oh my god what happened <laughs> What? So, so what? Someone die around here or something? <laughs> oh my God! Did someone else die? Oh, it's just your mom, your psychopath did mom. Okay, well, what's wrong? Else die? <laughs> <laughs> oh, her! You've had like three days to know about her. Why are you crying over it now? God, your mom jumped off the roof three days ago. Get over it, God. <laughs> I love I, I love I love the line. I kicked his foot and shot him a look and said, "Really?" And Kyle bit his lip and he's like, "Ah, I mean, ah, fuck." <laughs> Just what he says. I mean, ah, ah, ah fuck. God, ah, shit. Kyle's like, "Stupid, stupid, stupid." Yeah, exactly. Like, oh God, Kyle. <laughs> That's what he's doing. He's hitting his head. Why do you do this? <laughs> oh. uh, Kyle's my favorite. Okay. I've been to most of the continents with that job. I've been to India. You from India? My mum and dad are from India, yeah. I forgot, I need to do like a British, a British accent here. <laughs> My mum and dad are from India, yeah. That's actually, wow, that's pretty good. All right, anyway. See, I could tell. He'd been arrested once in Singapore, <laughs> after one of his packages had been found to be full of white powder. The Japanese are good people. Good manners. But they got all these urban legends and ghost stories that Hiroji was crazy for. Spent all his free time chasing them down. Like, you heard of Jorigumo? I don't think so. <laughs> well, she... <laughs> I'm sorry, but with that, that delivery, I imagine like a bewildered elf. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> oh, <that's good. laughs> okay. Well, she's the spider lady, lives in the Joro Falls <laughs> round easy. <laughs> Sorry. Your southern accent with this is so good. <laughs> well, she's a spider lady that lives in the Joro Falls around Azu. I'm sorry, is that not the caricature that you're I getting? just don't believe Rob is actually going to these places. But he seems to be a learned man, so who knows? <laughs> he, he's one of them educated types. He just talks yeah. too big. Okay. Anyway. 
Well, sure, before I was rudely interrupted. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. With, with a criticism over my Rob speak. <laughs> like, I don't understand the character. Okay. Well, she, well, she's the spotter like gosh. Oh, my God. A couple minutes before the movie started, a group of girls walked in. They were all pretty attractive, but whatever beauty they might have had was eclipsed by the girl with the dirty blonde hair, even though I had only caught a glimpse of her profile. As she oh, turned yeah. to move her... <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, as she turned to move yeah. her... <laughs> as she... <laughs> What's cooking good looking? As she turned... Oh. You better hope it says she's 19. <laughs> Yeah. The forty-two-year-old woman walked up. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, oh, that makes her only a couple decades younger than me. Yeah. I could, I just a couple. a couple. I'm still a cradle snatcher. <laughs> as she t- <laughs> oh, as she turned to move her seat, I caught a full a full view of her face, which gave me the feeling of butterflies in my stomach. It was Veronica. Fuck. But it's- <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I, I thought it was an older girl. It doesn't matter. I thought it was an older girl. No, chick. it was Veronica. Yeah. Right. That's why I was that's why I was like, bro. <laughs> I know, I know. I goofed. It was yeah, a goof. Yeah, yeah. That YouTuber slipping out of you. I know no, no, no. Quick, someone check his Twitter DMs. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, wait, don't, wait, don't, wait, wait, wait. don't look No, 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 no. I feel like now that I psychologically think that you has started these in-depth horror research videos because you are you're trying to find that connection that you missed a long time ago i feel mm. like you might be a car salesman wait a minute are you are, I'm, wait hold on <laughs> explain both of those things you just said <laughs> are you saying that i'm making youtube videos because i'm chasing the high i never caught of finding a dead yes, body absolutely okay. and, and what yes. do you mean by car salesman <laughs> I think that I think that you would have gotten your fix. Like you would have been like you would have seen some things. So I think it would have <laughs> corrupted you in some weird way <laughs> to where you would your life would have taken a more normal approach to maybe yeah, you would be like inter- enterprise cars, renting cars. And what, that would be like a coffee. Have, hold on, hold on. You're talking about like the high the glories of being a car salesman. What do you mean? <laughs> like, I think it's a pretty good gig. It's a market that's never going to die. <laughs> I just think that it's it's a more <laughs> traditional take. It's a more traditional take. The front didn't end up being much better. I could hear Mira crying over the store's dated music track. Her sobs. Jesus. <laughs> She's just like bawling her eyes out of the deal. This guy sitting there like making ham sandwiches. And Would you just like, like black olives with that? Yeah, scream crying in the back. <laughs> <laughs> her sobs went from pain. <laughs> her sobs went from painfully audible to muffled whispers. Oh my gosh! Yeah, and so she's like, ah! <laughs> and then it and then it turns out to <laughs> she's like throwing stuff like you hear stuff breaking. <laughs> well, not even that, but also just the extremely low turnout. To coincidentally, a woman who maybe knew too much. Mm, um, I see. Or something, or exa- or other people's priorities are somewhere else in the small town. Like, it just doesn't add up. Yeah. A classic Kyle line here would be like, well, maybe your mom was a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> maybe people just didn't like her, Kimber. Could that be it? <laughs> hey, Kimber, your mom was kind of a bitch, so she's, like, not that crazy, so I don't know, baby. I'm going to go get some cookies over there on the on the table. I'll be back. <laughs> Yo, they got free drinks here. Let's go. Yo, Kimber. Yeah, he's like across the deal. Yo, Kimber, they got tea. <laughs> <laughs> they got iced tea and cookies. Do, do you want some? I know you said it makes you bloated if you have it too early, yeah. but can you have it now? <laughs> I know you're worried about stretch marks, but if you want some chips ahoy, let me know. I know you're like fat and all, but these are pretty good. I guess you can have one. <laughs> He like to takes out his iPhone and puts it in his pocket. He's just playing Black and Yellow by Wiz Khalifa as loud as it possibly can go. Yeah, uh huh. He's like, you know what it is, Black and Yellow, Black and Yellow. Getting snacks and cold cuts at the table. <laughs> Everything I do, I do it big. <laughs> just a kid, just a kid at a funeral. Like, ah, uh, you know what it is. Like, not what, what caring. Would be, what would be? <laughs> what would be more obnoxious? 
A 16 year old listening to, to Wiz Khalifa, black and yellow, or if it was Fetty Wap's Trap Queen. That's the last you possibly can. What's my call sign? I thought about it. I was thinking London. You're from London, right? I'm from Bristol. <laughs> that makes it <sense>, switch. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry. Back is Rob. The kid seems to be about 12. One year younger than Jeff. He wears an Air Apostle shirt and ripped <laughs> blue jeans. <laughs> So Jeff and his brother are at the bus stand, and then this kid in a, as described, an Air Apostle shirt and ripped jeans jumps a skateboard over them. Well, 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 it looks like we got some new meat. <laughs> this is a 12-year-old. It's a 12-year-old. <laughs> Sud suddenly, two other kids appeared. One was super skinny, and the other was huge. Well, since you're new here, I'd like to introduce ourselves. <laughs> over there is Keith. Jeff and Lou look over to the skinny kid. He had a dopey face that you would expect a sidekick to have. <laughs> that's pretty. That's that's pretty mean to just be like he 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 looks like a sidekick. You're a sidekick, Keith. You look just like a sidekick. He's like really. <laughs> I'm Keith. <laughs> <laughs> and he's Troy. They look over at the fat kid. Talk about a tub of lard. <laughs> that's not that's not a quote. That's the story calling him a tub of lard. That's so oh my god. Yeah. From the story. Yeah. Talk about a tub of lard. Jeez. The narrator Christ. had to be like, this kid was fat. <laughs> Well, the, 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 read the next line. This kid looked like he had an exercise since he was crawling. What? Why is the narrator telling us that? <laughs> All the notes had to follow a loose structure, but we were allowed to be creative within those boundaries. My note was something like this. Hi, you found my balloon. My name is blank and I attend blank elementary school. You can keep the balloon, but I hope you write me back. I like Mighty Max, exploring, building forts, swimming, and friends. What do you like? Write me back soon. Here's a dollar for the mail. On the dollar, I wrote four stamps. Four stamps! <laughs> <laughs> it was in quotes. I had to do it. <laughs> you were so excited. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was great. All right. Uh, he wrote that. <laughs> I will say I'm just glad that you're at least doing Rob. It, it gives a yeah. nice, at least there's a, one voice that isn't mine in there. Yeah. Yeah. yeah although it would be funny to watch you <laughs> struggle yeah, through true. it. But now I'm, now I'm even Rob. I'll keep, you no, no, did I'll, good. <laughs> there, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah just, that's that's right. Now. What did I that's say? What, yeah. A, yeah. Is yeah, that your right, is that your Windigoon impersonation? What would you do yeah, yeah, if you what did What would you do if you did my voice? What would I do if I Uh you're kind of up in this register a little bit and you have a little <laughs> bit of like a, a southern twang to it. So you sometimes you're kind of up here is what I hear. <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> hello, hello gentlemen. Uh, I'm here to talk to you about a story. <laughs> Like I'm talking to me. Here, here, no, no, hearing it now, I'm like, that is the worst impression no, I think I've ever done. I think that's pretty good. <laughs> I think that's, we'll see what they have to say about it. Oh All right. It, 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 anyway, anyway, we need to get to the story. Uh, a little ways away from the shed, I found this in the middle of a clearing. What is this? And we have a little Easter bunny looking thing. That's like, I mean, at yeah. one point it was an Easter bunny. Now it's like vines grown over it. It looks decayed and like paint chipped mm -hmm. and stuff like that. But at one point it was right. like a little cute bunny decoration. Yeah, like almost like a yard gnome oh, looking thing. Oh, my, my wife opened the door. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like want to come say hi to everyone after that heart attack? This is going to be in the episode. <laughs> oh, it's just Hunter I'm talking to now. Oh, my gosh. Oh, say hi, Hunter. 
hello, that was very, very funny. <laughs> it's just so important for her to have a baby. And you know she blames me for our problems. Man, he's dumping on a 16-year-old. This I was going to say, this 16-year-old is... I mean, this is a fucking... This is a heavy load. <laughs> this is a lot. Yeah, you Good know... God. Do you know that my wife in there who's losing her job blames me for infertility? Do you know she thinks it's <laughs> fine? And he's like... I just, I'm still high. I'm ditching school oh, yeah, today. Yeah, well, exactly. He's like, he's like, did you know we got uh, Swiss cheese in? We offer Swiss cheese now? And he's like, I want her to be pregnant. We, I've been trying so hard. But you she, know she blames me, right? You're like, yeah, so Every we day got, she actually, looks at me got, like it's me. Do you know what that's like to look to come home and yeah. see? <laughs> so we actually make our own sourdough bread. Here. It's like just trying so hard to like get the fuck out of this conversation. And then I have to go to work. I have to provide for this house while she runs this dead end job. And then I'm the monster. I come home and it's me. I'm the devil. Yeah. So I'm hoping to graduate in two years. Like just like. <laughs> uh, okay. Do you want Pepsi with that or? Yeah. Um. In fact, it's about time I wheeled her out. Fair warning, Miss Sharma. She's a thing of beauty. To Rob Gathard, beauty took the form of a dark green Jeep Wrangler. Rob climbs Ooh. in. <laughs> Did you oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. A dark Jeep. <laughs> green Jeep Wrangler. Oh, God. You know what I like? I like the, the Jeep Wrangler from uh, How do you the beginning switch of in and out of that voice so fast? It's supernatural, <clears throat> my gosh. The you, you remember the, the the I think it was it was either a, a Jeep Grand Cherokee or it was a Jeep Wrangler in uh the beginning of Goonies. But that that style of Jeep back in the day, oh man. Good stuff. It was a good car. It was a good car. Good for you, that. Rob Guthard. Good for you. Yep. Rob, I like how you make that noise if it's Jeeps or questionably young women in stories. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, good God. This is just, oh, oh my word. Thank uh, you. Stop moaning. I can't, <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> Rob climbs in and lets it roll out of the garage, where it dominates every inch of the driveway. The car... <laughs> <laughs> as soon as oh, I read the, me. as soon as oh, I read the word dominates, every inch. Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh! The car is large. Mm. <laughs> I was waiting on it. Yeah, I know. I know you're waiting for that yeah, one. Yeah. All right. He had been found. I was sure of it. This person had found him and was hurting him. I broke oh out God. in tears. He was my only friend next to boxes. Okay. Th all right. Hold, hold on. Hold on, man. You can't. <laughs> he was my only friend next to boxes. <laughs> I can't believe my only human, my only friend, Josh, is getting beaten up by some stranger in his house. <laughs> my only friend next to my tiny kitty cat, boxes. <laughs> it's like, don't put them on the same level, dude. Come on. Well, my friend's getting... Touched and murdered by a, a stranger upstairs? Good thing I've got my kitty cat. Well, I hope that I can find my cat so I still have one friend. Man, I hope that if Josh is dead, I can still find my cat. Well, if, if, even if Boxes dies, he still has eight more lives, so it should be fine. <laughs> hey, Josh, he gets on the walkie. Hey, Josh, did you hear that? Boxes has eight more lives. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Josh, are you there? Josh! Are you there, Josh? Answer! <laughs> <laughs> like Josh, we have to find <laughs> Josh, we have to find boxes <laughs> someone's quick. In, someone, someone's in the house. What? <laughs> <laughs> I can't hear you. You got to talk louder. <laughs> Hold up. I'm going to scream really loud. Is that You're you? You're in my room upstairs to the left of that room. <laughs> <laughs> you said you were in the closet underneath in the, in the left corner, right? <laughs> Why are you hiding in there? <laughs> Here, follow the sound of my voice. Leetle, 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 leetle. Yeah. I'm going to keep beeping. I'm going to Beep. keep making noises. Hold on. This thing has a siren function. Let me try please, it. Please, 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 please be quiet. What? <laughs> I like that. Okay. I like, I, it's getting kind of, it's, it's, it's into the, it's into the cheesy realm of like, uh, you know, this is the part in the movie too, where. He says that, and his eyes are all he's all eyes are all jaundiced up, and he's looking around until they roll into the back of his head. He's like, "More, more, 
whatever. And then all the doctors look at each other and they're like, gulp, <laughs> right? <laughs> they probably don't say the word gulp, but they do gulp. And uh, I, I, it's it's a nice beat. Gulp. It's a nice beat. <laughs> gulp? I'm going to keep reading before okay. you keep slandering, digging this hole for yourself. Okay. All right, all right. Uh, all right. Okay. Next time you see Blue Jay, she's wearing Joker face paint. Yeah, she has a purple trench coat. <laughs> yeah, going through the trees. I'm a part. Y'all are running the game, and I'm just here to throw a wrench in your plans. <laughs> Why so serious? <laughs> <laughs> she's dragging Raw by his ankle. He's like bleeding. He's like, on the <laughs> they drag through the woods. <laughs> Why so? She serious. can't stand the sight of me anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then, uh, and then, what the fuck's his name? Who's the British guy in that movie? Michael Caine. Michael Caine's like, yeah. some people just want to watch the world burn. <laughs> I saw a baby holding the a, an emerald the size of a tangerine. <laughs> some people just want to watch the world burn. Your okay. right. They evolved to where it's like That's exactly what Michael Caine sounds like in those movies. <laughs> Mashed away. Mashed away. There was a jewel thief down <laughs> in Panama. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. All right. Party. Here we uh, go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mom, why would you invite us to some kid's party? If you haven't noticed, I'm not some dumb kid, which is so cliche of like, I'm older now, mom. I'm an old kid, but it doesn't come across as like also like genuine or charismatic. It comes across as fucking like annoying and it immediately <laughs> sets in my mind that Jeff is an incel. I, I, I immediately start seeing he's like a Reddit 4chan kid who's like, God. And then now, because then I started reading, I was like, oh, God, his lines read so much better. If his voice is like this, and he's like, Bob, why would you invite us to some kid's party? If you haven't noticed, I'm not some dumb kid. God. It's so much better as like a nasally annoying, like, it's a yeah, it's got we got moved into this fancy neighborhood. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> it does keep it does keep the tone of like, um, <laughs> don't you know I'm better than this? Don't you know I'm above all this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm supposed to be on Rude Skate. I don't want to be uh, hanging out with Billy. <laughs> I'm supposed to be killing rats in Rude Skate. I have better things to do than socialize, <laughs> Mom. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Part. Part nine. So he just, so this is once again, our little transcri English transcriber. So like I said, this is the, should be in British accent here. So let's uh -huh. read this uh, first part uh, here in a British, <clears throat> nice British accent. Sorry, I've not been in touch, guys. It's been a busy month. However, I'm pleased <laughs> to announce that as of yesterday night, I finally touched down in Phoenix, Arizona. <laughs> I'm... <I've, laughs> <I've, laughs> I'm posting this log from my first American hotel room, which offers a gorgeous view of both the state hospital and a local prison. Auspicious times. Drop me a line if you're in the city or if you have any information at all. <laughs> okay, so I want you to know that that's a better British accent than I've been doing, but you did sound like either AI or a robot butler. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Long... If you're in the city, or if you have any information <laughs> I, at all, that I had to align all of my chakras to get that out. Okay, I think so. I think it, it, it worked well. It worked very well. Good. I will say though, um, this does remind me. I'm actually getting flashbacks from my own childhood. Uh, in my music class, we could write to any musician. Oh, did you get a special and, uh, Polaroid from a musician? Uh, so I got a I got a postcard, and I wrote to Adam Sandler. That was the musician. <laughs> I chose. Okay. Because at the time I had a I had a comedy CD from him called Everybody's Gonna Laugh at You, and uh, I remember I got a thing back and it was signed and it's obvious it was so obviously fake but I remember at the time I was like whoa holy Wait, moly your teachers fake to signed Adam Sandler letter that I can only imagine there it was never verified so it very well could be but and, like looking back on it I was like there's no way there's just Wait, simply do no you still way have that, that letter happened. maybe bro I'd have to I I I, I think for a very long time. I was like, this is just fake. I might have pitched it. I don't know. No, bro. If you still have, what if it's real? What if one day, like, what? What if one day, 
when you're 87 years old, you know, <laughs> wow. 10 years could from you, now. Could you, a, <laughs> could you, like, listen to yourself. Could you imagine, Hutto, if you had an Adam Sandler signature? <laughs> I will say, oh. No, I'm no, okay, up, hold I'm on. Looking, I'm, I'm, looking up, I'm looking up images of it right now, and the signature does look very similar. Because he, he did draw a, uh, he drew a smiley face on mine. And then one of these things okay, here well, on Google for one, images, you're making, you're making fun of me for the signature thing. I'm saying it would be cool... If like he sent a, if he sent a signed copy of the CD to someone who became like a, a famous internet, like comedian personality, right? Like that would be a cool stepping stone. You hear about like, oh, this director got a letter from Scorsese when they were a kid or whatever, right? I'm saying it'd be mm. neat for that reason. Not that. <laughs> when I, when I was listening to you, I was, I legitimately thought you were being like, <laughs> I thought you were legitimately being like. Can you even imagine if you had Adam Sandler's <laughs> signature right now? That I'm, that's what I'm starstruck by. Yeah, you're yeah. Like, oh my gosh, <laughs> really? Did you, did Mr. Sandler touch that? No. Are you saying, are you saying Mr. Sandler touched pen and he touched ink and quill on that picture? What's it smell like? <laughs> it smells like Adam. <laughs> give it, give me the letter, give me the letter, give it! The nagging feeling that the day ahead will be one of bitter and immediate consequences. I mean, yeah, she's got to walk back and be like, oh, Clyde's dead, by the way. Yeah, Clyde, Clive uh, killed himself. Yeah, Sorry about and I, that. And I also uh, was there and facilitated it, so that's me present. But I heard his life story, and it was beautiful. But don't worry, he wanted it to happen so yeah, he was very he said as he was disintegrating he just kept chanting pog over and over again it was very <laughs> it was very it was very very cool and then finally as he drew his last breath he just said based and then he just <laughs> immediately disintegrated into fine ash <laughs> pog pog, she pog! Wrote, she, she's writing in her notes as he's disintegrating chat yeah, is this I, pog, real pog. yeah chat <laughs> Chat, chat, is this, chat, is this real? Is, is this, this real, real chat? Is this real chat? Is this real chat? I, I, I don't I know, chat. I can't believe what I'm seeing. I can't believe what I'm seeing, chat. Is this real? Have you seen the... Oh. <laughs> I was about to ask. Oh my gosh, I was about to ask if you've seen the animation of XQC. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so stupid. For those that don't know, I was just about to ask Hunter if he's seen Hunter's animation. <laughs> that, yeah, I've that, seen it a couple times. That that meme comes from. Oh my gosh. All right. Oh, Chet. Chet, I can't believe it's real, Chet. Oh my god, Chet. <laughs> wow, Chet, wow. <laughs> I forget that you're important. Okay. <laughs> anyway. So Jeff confesses to the crime. And which is funny, I do like that this is also a direct quote. The officer literally says, after Jeff's like, yeah, I did it. All right, I did it. The officer says, well, kid, looks like a year in juvie. <laughs> what, what kind of response is that? Well, kid, damn. That's not looks like you got, a, you got a year in juvie coming your way. Ah, that, you know what? You boys. know what? That actually further backs up your theory that this was written by, like, a kid. Or, like, you know, pre I'm telling you. high school, whatever. It because, has to be. Because uh, only they would think that, like, the way it works is a cop shows up. And it's like, you stabbed this kid? <laughs> well, I'll put you in juvie a year. Come on. <laughs> like, right. <laughs> Direct to juvie with you, son. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Looks like one, one exact year of juvie coming your way. I frowned a little, unsure what Bonnie means. She smiles back blankly, then resumes the path back to her car. She's no, mentioned that pla Yeah. <laughs> she She's smiles been... back blankly. Like, oh, good guy. <laughs> a blank smile? That's a horrified phrase. It'll all be fine once we get to Wintery Bay. Yes. <laughs> Perfect Wintery Bay. <laughs> you want to explain on that further? Good night. <laughs> uh, Clyde snores. Yeah, she like unzips her tent. You just hear like... <laughs> Like a guy like dying of snoring in there, <laughs> like a giant CPAP machine sound. <laughs> they have a CPAP in the car. <laughs> yeah, from a generator. Ah, <laughs> uh, wintry bay, here we come. <laughs>
<laughs> just the weirdest people you've ever met. Just... <laughs> yeah. I know I don't talk much, but I'm going to scare the shit out of you immediately. <laughs> Wintery Bay. <laughs> With victory oh, pay. That's that's funny. That's a funny phrase to say to people out of context. It will be fine when we get to Wintery Bay and just like yeah, <laughs> total excuse elaborate. Excuse me. Excuse me. Like I'll, you're in the line at like a grocery store. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? They're like, oh, what? Oh, nothing. <laughs> See you there. I would I wouldn't worry about it if I were you. Don't even worry your little head. <laughs> Worrying makes it hungry. She Wait, smiled. She, she's, oh yeah, yeah, you're right. You, you said the L here. She smiled, and I was about to suggest that maybe we could sit together when she quickly closed the space between us and hugged me. Oh. Oh, goddamn. Oh, man. It, okay. was, it was really good to see you. <laughs> <laughs> she said with her arms around me. I was trying to think of what to say when I realized the biggest problem was that I had forgotten how to talk. Luckily, Ryan, who I could hear approaching from the hallway, came in and spoke for me. Dude, you know the movie's over, right? Let's get the fuck out of Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Veronica let go and said that she'd see me next time. She was played out of the room by the porn music Ryan was making <laughs> with his mouth. I was, <laughs> I was furious, but it dissipated as soon as I heard Veronica laughing in the lobby. Hey, your girlfriend's Yo, Kimber's you. dad. The food here is kind of mid, bro. <laughs> Yo, Kimber's dad. You shouldn't have got that shitty ass <laughs> sandwich shop to cater. This shit sucks. <laughs> Yo, your wife looks mad funny in that box, dude. <laughs> you pay, you didn't need, pay for that, problem. did you? She looks awful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she looks like a weird clown, dude. Tell me you did not pay for that. Okay, you didn't? Okay, cool. Uh, what happened to her face? Oh, yeah, the concrete. That's right. Oh. Well, you should, you should have, like, put a mask on her or something. My God. Yo. Yo, who else thinks we should bring Death Mask back? Anyone? <laughs> mean, meanwhile, just <laughs> softly, I'm like, hey, what's up, hello? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, hey, what's up, hello? Coming to pretty as soon as you came in the door. <laughs> Yo, disrespectful of me to, like, go to an open casket, look inside, and yeah. you're just like, I've been cooking pies with my baby. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh I'm God, bored. Your I want to so listen much. to music. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Exactly. <laughs> what? I'm bored. I'm bored. <laughs> hey, baby, this is really lame. I'm going to get out of here. Hey, do you guys have like an ox cord or something? <laughs> yeah, you guys got an ox cord. He actually doesn't even have a button up on. He just has one of those graphic tees you find at Walmart. <laughs> Target or Walmart that's like a fate like they purposely faded it. It's like a Sega sh like a Sonic shirt it's, for some It's like the like, shirts. I came, I it's like the shirts that Jesse Pinkman would wear in Breaking Bad. Like they've got like all the the Thrasher font that says like live and oh, die. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It goes down to yeah, his yeah, knees. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I came here my Sunday's best. <laughs> Okay, where, where, where are okay, we anyway. Yeah, yeah, so her, her mom's dead. Kimber's mom's dead, I think. <laughs> it's pretty good. Um, did, did you, uh, did you do the part about the severed hand in the tree? Yeah. Okay, cool, all right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we would have gotten here sooner if we had to drop by to get some blankets. Pleasure to meet you, ma'am. Pleasure to meet you, too. <laughs> would you would you be the journalist? That's right. <laughs> you, used to, you used to write for the town paper, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, that's right. This is like your schizophrenia hey. setting. <laughs> yeah, which I know I'm like, yeah, that's right. You used to write for the town paper, didn't you? <laughs> I'm a little girl. I'm a little girl. I'm a little girl. <laughs> it's all your different like characters like crumbling yeah. in on each other. <laughs> this is it. This is his mental break. I can't wait. 
Uh, I'm, I'm going to let viewers know, too, there's a lot of characters coming up, and this is going to get very messy. So if you're not on YouTube watching this and you can see the characters' names there, I'm sorry. It's going to get very <laughs> sloppy. You know, it's, it's pretty funny because, like, initially I was like, oh, maybe he doesn't have enough to read. But now that I'm looking down, I'm like, nah, he's fine. <laughs> oh, I got No, I, got, <laughs> okay. I, I have plenty. I have plenty. Jeff saw his bruised nose. I think we're even. I beat the crap out of you, <laughs> and you got my brother sent to JDC. This does feel like an anime. <laughs> like, I'm telling you. I think we're even. I beat the crap out of you, and you got my brother sent to JDC. <laughs> <laughs> They're making those weird, like, moaning noise to themselves yeah. as the other's <laughs> talking. God. Uh. Bah. Mm. Uh, like yeah. Mm. <laughs> Hello, Jeff. Is it? He said, and he put he pushes up his glasses or whatever with his pinky, and he's like, "We have some unfinished business." <laughs> All right. R Randy got a <laughs> Randy got an angry look in his eyes. Oh no, I don't go for even. I go for winning. Oh gosh. <laughs> God. Good lord. I go. Oh, all right, hold on. I have to lean into it. <clears throat> <laughs> Oh no, I don't go for even. I go for winning. You may have kicked our asses that one day, but not today. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just caught what you were doing, they're like, uh <laughs> After removing my fleece and lying down for just a moment, I end up sleeping in the clothes I'm wearing. Uh, at, at some point, I'd walk up to Rob and be like, Rob, we gotta kill her. <laughs> hey, Rob. <laughs> yes? Uh, Bonnie is pretty sure she's gonna, she's gonna kill us. I'm almost positive she's gonna kill us. Well, we got a lot of territory to chart, and Clyde's just like, I don't know why you guys are being so weird to my sister. Stop being so weird to my sister, she's fine. She's like, trying to eat her own face in the back seat of the car. <laughs> She's just she's like weird vib like that. She's vibrating, speaking Latin behind, yeah, behind like, the seat. <laughs> Alright, so do we have to go home then or what? <laughs> if we have I to don't go know home, what the big is. She does this, I don't know why okay? you're being so weird. God. It's that time of the yeah. month. She gets like this. <laughs> she all. talked to a demon. Who cares? God. <laughs> I, you know, I really thought... When you were when you were being Alice just said that you're gonna go, uh, Rob, you're gonna want to see this. <laughs> uh, Rob, yeah, you're gonna want to see this. Uh, she's, she's right, right behind. behind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 you get it. Know. You know what I'm yeah. saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Rob, she's right. Oh, yeah. All right. <clears throat> Let's dive right in. Do you want to take the first section or me? I will. I'll, I'll take it. Which, it starts off by saying, Tonight's kind of a catalyst for this post. I just received another message, and it's worse than any of the others. My girlfriend died on the 7th of August, 2012. Yeah, she was at the LMFAO album release party at Best Buy. <laughs> <laughs> she got tricked with death. Uh, um, <laughs> All right. Thank you. Anyway, she was involved... <laughs> She was involved the in a three all right. Like, all right, I'll have fail. I'll all calm right. down. I know those get right. you going. Well, too, I'll too, be... early, too early, too early, too <laughs> early. And I return to the cold, unforgiving earth. It doesn't welcome me back. I hit the slope. Man, she must have been falling for a while, huh? Yeah, I mean, if she, like, had glide to, to have, time. I'm going to guess. To have that kind of, yeah. That, yeah, I'm going to guess she lives because the dead deer break her fall. Um, But she's got, like, or she break. impales herself on all the antlers. Yeah, she's got to break a bone or something, at least, right? <laughs> I, yeah, I, I hit the slope. Yeah, she's got to break a bone or something. I think, definitely. Is that me? She's break arm. Is that what yeah. you're doing? Is that me? Is that my voice? Yeah, that's you. That's what you Stop that. Cut yeah. that out. Hey. Yeah, probably got to break quit a that. wrist. Probably. Hey, no, I don't. I don't like the direction. It's funny when we're making fun of the British people. <laughs> Cut that out. <laughs> I hit the slope, immediately bouncing off one shoulder and landing on the Boing? other. <laughs> That's what I think of immediately bouncing. Boing. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Hunter. That's the sound people make when they hit the ground really hard. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Minecraft Steve noise. Okay. <laughs> I couldn't figure out what it was from a distance, so I went closer, trying to be as quiet as I could. When I actually got close enough to see what it was, my mouth literally fell open. It was eggs. 
Huge eggs, all in a cluster, like a nest. Oh my god, dude. What are we, what are we getting at? What are we, these are, what is happening now? I'm, I'm so lost in this story. Like, is this going to be about a giant fucking chicken, dude? What are we doing here? If, I, if, it, if this turns into a giant rooster, I am going to be so pissed. Even the giant red, it, it, the speedy, a speedy chicken cross the road. Oh my god! How did the chicken cross the road? Are, is this seriously where we're going, dude? That's what happened. Or, oh. Why don't you find out? We're we're, get, we're gonna find. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, they were enormous. It's hard to explain their size, but you can sort of see them in relation to my boot here. So... What do you mean, it's hard to explain? I see them. They're <laughs> giant. In the, previous, in the previous photo, there's a tree, and they dwarf the tree. It's literally... the, the These eggs are like... What? They're a bigger foot than of, a basketball. Yeah, they're like basketball size. Just these big, yeah. giant white eggs in the middle of the forest, yeah. Nah, she didn't show. None of them did. I didn't believe it all until we went to uh, Alcagara. Sh sure. Al oh, Alcagara. 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 Wait. <laughs> Alcagara. Sir, if you've been there for so long, how do you not know how uh, to say it? Listen, little Missy, I don't even think that you're <laughs> real. I don't, I don't know what you is, but it ain't right. Why do you say such horrible things? No, to me? I don't see now you're whispering, and that that makes me all kinds of bothered <laughs> and uncomfortable, and I don't stand for it, <laughs> ma'am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you done got me riled. That's it. I'm getting my gun. <laughs> Did you find anything in the Agahari? Our Kagahara? I thought. In the unaliving I, forest? I, I, thought, I thought I couldn't pronounce it. Now you can't pronounce it. What's this about, you well, little educated lady, yeah. British lady? I, I wouldn't say I'm a cultured woman. I just wanted to know if, you, if you've seen any. Did you find oh, anything? Oh, I, I see there? how it is. You think you're all sophisticated better than me just because I'm from down here in Phoenix. Yes. Well, let me tell you this. Yes. You think that it's fine for you to mispronounce it, but when I mispronounce it, it's because I'm some dumb yokel. Is that right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, that just... Now, Rob, I need you to <laughs> just get back to the fucking story, you deranged old man. <laughs> <laughs> well, that ain't quite Christian of you now, is it? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Has Mira told you about her um, appointments? Uh, what? no. Well, we've been trying to get pregnant for years. Long, painful years. <laughs> <laughs> kind of a... <laughs> Long, painful years. I'm sorry, it's not funny. It's not funny. It's just such... <laughs> I have the brain of a 12 year old, I'm sorry. <laughs> long, painful years. Okay. okay. All I could do is hold on to my recollection of the night before, reminding myself of the sense of calm, finality that radiated from Klein when I confronted him. All I can do is trust that I made the right call. No. No, there wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> this is the time when you decide to <laughs> that, that, that. <laughs> I told you it was going to drop at some point <laughs> uh, <laughs> thank you for not doing it as Clyde was walking off last night yeah Yeah. We, did, did the thought we come to you? Clyde. be honest, did the thought come to you to do it then? No, I, I was honestly waiting to see if like you could go to like an even like way way down the road kind of thing <laughs> And just, you know, be like, Rob, I don't think I'm gonna make it. <laughs> <laughs> Rob, I think I might need a point in a bloody way of bloody skull, mate. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so he smashes his vodka over Jeff's head and goes, Fight! He throws Jeff back into the living room. Come on, Jeff, look at me. Je Jeff glances up, his face riddled with blood. <laughs> I was the one who got your <laughs> <laughs> oh, This is so good. 
I was the one who got your brother sent to JDC. And now, you're just gonna sit there and let him rot in there for a whole year? You should be ashamed. <laughs> Jeff starts to get up. Oh, finally! You stand and fight! <laughs> oh, finally! You stand and fight! Jeff is now to his feet, blood and vodka on his face. Once again, he gets that strange feeling. <laughs> he gets that. <laughs> he gets I got a feeling. <laughs> Ooh. That's a, that's a... Oh my gosh! The feeling keeps showing up. Once again, he gets that strange feeling, the one in which he hasn't felt for a while. I thought he was feeling it that day. Or okay, he's what? felt it continuously for through a the whole story. Week now. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Finally, he's up, says... In my head, Randy sounds like Vegeta. Like, <laughs> every... Finally, he's up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Finally, <laughs> he's up, says Randy as he runs at Jeff. That's when it happens. Something inside Jeff snaps. His psyche is destroyed. All rational thinking is gone. All he can do is kill. <laughs> He grabs Randy and pile drives him to the ground. He gets on top of him and punches him straight in the heart. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whoa! He like, he, the punch causes Randy's heart to stop? No! No way! <laughs> this 13 year old just punched a 12 year old's heart and Kill! Did, did kill him? He punches him in the chest? He one punched him? What the heck? <laughs> Gives him the fucking five figure death punch from Kill Bill. <laughs> this is the strongest 13 year old ever. He literally punched it. I was joking about this being like a Dragon Ball fight. This is actually a I'm Dragon telling, Ball yeah. fight. Yes. No, that's that's actually very you. I think Blue Jay would have appreciated the information last night. <laughs> yeah, well, she didn't ask. I'm glad you made it, Rob. Glad you made it too. They're building tough down in London. I rest my head back against the luggage. I'm from Bristol. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Yeah, yeah, of course. That's, uh, sorry. <laughs> that is, that is a lot of heavy things that I'm sure Sam cannot unpack. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. It's especially for a 16 year old who works at a sandwich shop. Yeah, so okay. they say mayo is the sauce of the aristocrat. <laughs> <laughs> this poor kid. He's like the guy's just like what? <laughs> All right, well, <laughs> he like claps his hands. I'll talk to you later, Mister. <laughs> And Cal's like, what was that? He's like, I just want to give him something to thank on. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. <laughs> He's totally bought. <laughs> that's, what, that's what Sam would say. Everything's perfect. Gets him every time. Yeah. Not that bad. It's perfect. His family were equally surprised. Jeff started laughing uncontrollably. His parents <laughs> noticed that his left eye and hand were twitching. Uh, Jeff... <laughs> Uh... <laughs> uh, Jeff? Are you okay? <laughs> okay? I've never felt more happy! <laughs> Look at this face! It goes perfectly with me! He couldn't stop laughing. He stroked his face, feeling it, looking at it in the mirror. What caused this? Well, you may recall that when Jeff... <laughs> It's written. Well, you may recall that when Jeff was fighting Randy, something in his mind, his sanity snapped. Now he was left as a crazy killing machine. That is, <laughs> his parents didn't know. Doc doctor, said Jeff's mom, is my son all right? <laughs> you know, in the head. Every part of that paragraph is absolutely insane. The idea Bold. of Jeff, like, Getting burns on his face, like laughing, loving his face. And then, that's so good, the, uh, Jeff. 
Jim, it's the are you all right? It's the equivalent of like the whole, uh, guys, you're going to want to see this. <laughs> uh, guys, he's right behind me. He's right it? behind me. 